is Marina Ciccarelli. I'm from the School of Occupational Therapy and Social Work in the Faculty of Health Sciences. Um, I'm the coordinator of one of the uh, first year uh, common units uh, in the Faculty of Health Sciences. And this means that uh, each year we have about 2,500 first year students enrolled in the unit. And the unit's Evidence Informed Health Practice 100. With such large numbers coming from diverse um, uh, health profession disciplines, the challenge was how did we, how would we uh, have these students in class feeling that they had a sense of belonging. Uh, we have a Blackboard site for evidence informed health practice and students were asked to um, uh, prepare each week uh, before they came to class and also uh, to be able to summarise what they'd learnt each week in class. So we randomly selected teams uh, to do a posting to the wiki. This required them not just to regurgitate the learning content for that week, but to, to summarise it and to have a student voice. Uh, this would allow them to, to post that and other students to be able to see what did we actually cover this week, why was it important, what was surprising, what was um, something that they perhaps didn't agree with. And uh, all of the uh, teams each week from each of the different laboratories and our external students would post their, their wiki posting and other students were encouraged to go online, read it, and put some comments up against it. It was anticipated that this would help students on a weekly basis review the learning content, to be responsible for uh, their own learning, their own sharing, and that it was more of a student-led activity. No surprise, they, they found the, the wiki um, uh, um, onerous to do even though they only had to do it once in the in the semester and again I believe that was probably because there were no uh, formal marks allocated to it and I guess I didn't want to allocate marks because I wanted this to be a learning process we've always said to students that your final assessments will be individual assessments but that your learning should be group learning you should um, put your heads together ask questions of one another really share your understanding share your questions with one another uh, because you're going to get a much richer and deeper understanding of the information yeah. we used another technology and this was more so for uh, on-campus students and it was the audience response devices um, students often refer to them as clickers we used it in class to facilitate students in their revision of learning content so we could put up um, you know five multi-choice questions uh, that might uh, ask them information around a task they've just done in class today so this was their way to participate fully but anonymously to get the feedback that was important for them particularly in the early stages to let students know how they're doing and also for them to feel as though they're part of the group discussion. We didn't have the opportunity for fully online students to come together each week as a group. Uh, we did provide opportunity for some Illuminate sessions that were provided particularly in the weeks leading up to major pieces of assessment. It allowed students to come online, ask questions uh, um, uh, live with the, with the tutor around the assessment and anything else with regards to the learning content. The only other thing that I would want to say is that we often uh, take for granted that students will be tech savvy uh, and that's not necessarily the case for all students. So it's really important that if um, certain technologies are going to be utilised for learning that there are very clear directions as to how students log on, engage, uh, the different kinds of operating systems that they might be using on their computers and um, you know really talking them through that uh, and that can probably best be done with the use of a little um, uh, video and uh, we provided some Echo 360 videos that actually talk students through how to engage with the, um, the, the materials that they were going to be using uh, in the unit.